Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2023 Panini Donruss Football. Three hobby boxes, random team break number two, one spot gets you two teams, all card ship, looking for downtowns, looking for the rated rookies, looking for all that fun stuff. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Let's double you up, uh, double up, uh, uh. And there are the teams right there. All teams are in, let's roll it, randomize it. Three and a two, five times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, and five. Paul down to Paul. Three and a two, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and five. After five, we got the Tehans down to the Pets. All right, Paul with the Houston Texans, Tristan with the Colts, Joe, you got my Raiders, Nick, Commanders and Panthers, Sal with the Steelers, David with the Buccaneers, Nick with the Dolphins, Royce with the Jaguars, David with the Vikings, Lucas with the Giants, Chad Daw, Last Bot and Mojo with the Buffalo Bills, Royce, Titans, Tristan with the Packers, Adam with the Ravens, Joe with the Cardinals, Tristan with the Broncos and Cowboys, Ronnie with the Chiefs, Nick with the Eagles, Brown, Saints, Sal with the Chargers, Ronnie with the Rams, uh, Nick with the Falcons, Chad, Last Spot Mojo, Bears, Nick with the Patriots, Tristan with the Lions and Bengals, Lucas with the Seahawks, Adam with the Niners, Paul with the Jets. Excuse me, Joe with the Sneeze and Paul with the Jets. That's it. Why, why my allergies are firing up here. So there you go. Uh, let's uh, alphabetize by team. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, I'm going to go grab those three boxes. We'll come back, see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. So stick around, BRB. All right, so no deals were done, so the list remains the same. There was a little bit of trade chatter, but nothing happened. It's all good. Here on a Friday. Thanks for spending uh, your Friday night with me. I appreciate that. I just don't work on Fridays, but here I am. I switched with Jason. I was out of town last weekend. And we're back here. All right. Got a little Australian Open tennis on the background. I think we're in the, what, round of 16, probably getting into quarterfinal action soon. So kind of... So Polly Shore is gonna play Richard Simmons in a movie, and now Richard Simmons came out in a rare statement and said he gave no permission for the movie. Hmm. I met Richard Simmons once. In a life before Jaspies, I was working uh, at a, uh, a high-end consignment uh, store. And he, he was there with an assistant looking at stuff. It's very nice. Yeah, I mean, flamboyant dude. Super, super nice though. But, I mean, you know, you can't stop people from making content about you, though. It'll just be an unauthorized, you know, biopic of, of Richard Simmons. Uh, you didn't see it? Well, I didn't know if it was like, you know, you never know if it's like an act. You know, if you're turning it up for the cameras or not. But I think he was pretty true to form. So 
So we're looking for one autograph and one memorabilia per box on average. There's Khalil Shakir. Uh, six out of ten. Nice low number there. Nice low number. This might be... This player might be the key to the Bills' success. This is going to go to uh, this weekend. It's going to go to Chad. We do have a poll, a Twitter poll we loaded up. If anybody wants to, to vote there, you can... Uh, Vote on our Twitter poll. We've got polls up for all of the playoff games this weekend. Nice Jameer Gibbs, the rookies. We'll see him in action this weekend, Tristan, with the Lions. Say Flowers could blow the top off that Texan secondary. Darrell Revis Legend Series. Stetson Bennett. Devonta Smith. CD Lamb. Madre Stevenson is numbered. It is to 500. Patriots, new look Patriots next year maybe. No more Belichick, so they're they're, they're just really. New coach. Let's see if what they'll do in the off season. Are they going to get a quarterback? There's all sorts of direct things they need to do on that team. Sam Laporta rated rookie card for the Lions and Devontae Adams Dominator's autograph. Nice. My Raiders signing uh, officially, well, taking the interim tag off of Antonio Pierce. He's the head coach now. Guys like Devontae Adams will be happy, among others. 43 out of 50. Joe with my Raiders. Nice. My Raiders have quarterback questions too. Sam Laporta will go to Tristan. There should be a relic in here somewhere. Raheem Mostert to 500. And we got all pro kings, Quinn and Williams. 321 out of 399. J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Paul with the Jets. Tank, William, Isaiah, Pacheco to 100. That'll be a big key uh, for the Chiefs if, you want, if they want to have some success in Buffalo. Take a look at those Twitter polls. Let's get an update. I don't think much has changed since the morning, even though there have been some more votes. Uh, Texans at Ravens. Who does everyone have there? The voting public says 75% say they're on the Texans. It's a lot. 
I'm on the Texans, plus nine and a half. Am I fading the, am I, should, should I be fading the public? Is this not a good sign? It's not a good, man, it's not a good sign. I feel like there'll be a little bit of rut. I don't think the Ravens are going to lose, obviously, but I think I could see like I can see like the Texans making a backdoor cover like in the fourth quarter. You know, they're they'd be down by 14 or something like that, they'd be down by 20 or something. I mean, a couple garbage touchdowns here and there. Maybe maybe the Ravens, you know, take the foot off the gas a tiny bit. The Texans can kind of sneak in there. That's my that's my game story. This is the old fourth quarter back to our cover. I'll probably be down most of the game and then some fourth quarter points will help him out. Zay Flowers, I don't know how they're gonna stop guys like him. Though. There's Jan Senaru. And we've got a Elite Series Hendon Hooker for Detroit. Say some Zay Flowers is for, uh, for Adam and the Ravens. Who knows what will happen with him this playoff run. Hey, Bryce Young, nice. That's for Carolina. That's going to be for Nick Stover. I don't think we saw any Bryce Youngs in the first few boxes we did. So Will Levis as well. Got to hang on to those QBs. Jalen Waddell. Royce with the Titans. And a Brock Purdy. 7 out of 50. Gold Brock Purdy. Nice. Adam with the Niners. Well, that is the next game we can talk about. It's right on, right on cue, Brock. Uh, Green Bay in San Francisco. Spreads 9.5, 64.7% on Green Bay plus 9.5. Who wins that matchup? Same thing with the Niners. They've they they've had a week off. Packers seem to be seem to be a lot tougher than uh, than people may think. You know, so I think different kind of game script though. I think I think they will be kind of close throughout the game. I think maybe the Niners will end up pulling it off towards the end, but it might come down to whoever has the ball last. I think it might be one of those games. You know, I feel like maybe the Packers will start out fast. Niners will start to catch up. We'll see what happens there. Oh, Rex, your life is complete. Green Day did a thing with Jimmy Fallon in the subway like he does with the bands. Billy Joe looked like David Spade, so he tweeted out, and David Spade liked your tweet. Or, or his assistant did. The assistant that runs the Twitter account. Where is where does Russell where does where does Russell Wilson go? I think I where does he go? It's Kieran Williams. Nice die cut. 
to 75. That'll be for Ronnie and the Rams. The Aqua Test Stamp, Trevor Etienne. Trey Tucker, Baker Mayfield. Rob Gronkowski, on-card autograph, Buccaneers. David Yang, there you go, Dave. Roquan Smith, Tyreek Hill, Deuce Vaughn. Billy Joe must be younger than David Spade, right? That's, that's why they were like, yeah, I do look like a young guy. 48 out of 50, Fred Warner, Niners, Adam. And Jersey Kings, nice Devontae Adams. Had his auto earlier, and now a piece of his jersey to $3.99. Joe with the Raiders. All the Raiders need to do, get a nice offensive coordinator. You know, refresh the, the, the team and the defense in the draft. Maybe some offensive line help. Maybe they get a quarterback in the draft. You know, and keep building. You know, this guy will have an, another year of experience under his belt. Want all of that. And then profit. Like the, uh, like the underpants gnomes. All right, third and final box. Good luck. The third game, that's on a Sunday. So we got Houston at Baltimore, early game, 1.30 p.m. tomorrow. Then we've got uh, Packers at Niners. Then the early game on, the first game on Sunday, Buccaneers at Lions. 70% of voters laying the points with the, with the Lions, minus six and a half. Maybe I should be... Betting oppo these these plays. I'm, that's the old thing. Bet against the public. I might have made really square picks here. So plenty of time to vote, ladies and gentlemen. I've, I've scheduled these uh, these polls. If I did it right, I scheduled these polls to end uh, right around game time. So retweet it, share with share it with your friends, all that sort of stuff. The final game, of course, is Chiefs at Bills. 73% taking the Bills, minus two and a half. All right, third and final box. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Let's try to end with a... Something monstrous here. A low numbered CJ Stroud would be nice. There's his teammate, Will Anderson. 
There's Josh. Oh, that's numbered card. Where's there's Josh Allen? If you look at uh, the break schedule that Nightbot just dropped and go to the, um, it'll take you to a Google spreadsheet. There's Carl Loftus to 100. And then on the bottom, there'll be a tab that says Joe's Picks. If you click on that, you'll see my official NFL picks. Ah, or let's find some more Anthony Richardsons. Here's a Gridiron Kings Anthony Richardson. That'll be for Tristan and the Colts. Tyree Wilson for my Raiders, DTR. Michael Wilson for the Cardinals. Got Brian Robinson Jr. to 500. Nick and the Commanders. Sam Laporta rated rookie card. Saquon. And Hunter Renfro autograph, throwing that around. Power plus auto. So we got two Raiders receivers, Joe. Now, I don't know what happened with Hunter Renfro. I feel like Josh McDaniels broke Hunter Renfro, 31 out of 99. The season before, we were calling him, we his nickname was Third and Renfro. Always be counted on to convert in a third down passing situation. You know, what can there's always there were videos of incredible footwork and routes that he would run to 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 trick people in the red zone. He almost had a hundred catches. I don't know something like that. But as soon as Josh McDaniels came on board, and for initially, I, I think Raiders fans were excited because they were like, "Wow, oh, Josh McDaniels has you know has worked wonders with you know with with white receivers, right? Wes Welker and Julian Edelman stuff like that. So like there was obvious like comparisons there. And I don't know, it just never material. I didn't like him for some reason. I don't know what happened. There's gonna have to be a fun thirty for thirty or something like that 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 comes out and just tell. Maybe after some of these guys retire, we'll you know we'll tell the true story about what happened in those that years that season and a half. But but I think he broke them. And obviously they were kind of still running that. You know you can't really do a full new playbook install, you know, in the middle of the season. So I think they were still kind of running the Josh McDaniel plays, I guess, that still hate those plays that still hate Hunter Renfro. Forget what his contract situation is. Maybe he's a candidate to be traded at this point. Uh, maybe it was never that good in the first. I have no idea, but I feel like he deserves another year with the Raiders. Give that a shot, you know, and see see if we can bring him back to his old form. That That would be great for everybody. That opens... Opens up space for everybody. There's Travis Kelsey. 349 out of 399. Down year for Kelsey, but you know, maybe he's just he's just gonna turn it on for the playoffs. That's gonna be for Ronnie and the Chiefs. But yeah, I mean if they can if Hunter Renfro can be unlocked, that would be great. Because you know, you guys know football. It's a pretty obvious. It opens opens up space for everybody. Devontae Adams has room to operate. Trey Tucker has room to room to operate. Stretch the field. Right? While Michael Meyer and uh, the tight end and Hunter Renfro work underneath in the flats. Josh Jacobs balancing out that offense. I mean, I don't know why the offense has struggled as much as it did last year last year but you know, hopefully they'll figure it out okay hey, little 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 refresh via draft and oh nice KJ Henry out of 50 it's for Nick
if they can refresh the team a little bit in the draft and through free agency and maybe some trades here and there. Get the right offensive coordinator. Hopefully it'll it'll work itself out. And that's that, boys and girls. Three box of 2023 Panini Don Football Hobby Edition in the books. One spot gets you two. Another three box in the store. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next football break. Bye-bye.